What a privilege it is to bring very special greetings to our church members in Saba. It was a great privilege to be with so many of you uh, at the stadium, the badminton stadium, last evening, and to enjoy and appreciate the possibility of being together as a family. But many of you were not there, and I want to thank you for the wonderful witness that each of you are making for the Lord himself here in this uh, wonderful state of Saba here in Malaysia. I want to encourage you to follow step by step what the Lord wants you to do in total member involvement. Everybody doing something for Jesus. For I believe, as you do, that Jesus is coming very, very soon. He's intending to use you as a personal ambassador for him. You know, the Bible tells us in uh, the beautiful uh, book of uh, Corinthians in chapter 5, it tells us about each of us being called to be ambassadors for Christ. And I would ask you to follow that in a very wonderful way and realize that it is a personal invitation to you to be a follower of the Lord and to be his special emissary touching people's lives in practical ways, helping family and friends to understand the benefits of good physical health and spiritual health. You see, the Lord intends for us to help people physically, mentally, socially, and spiritually. And here in Saba, I am so delighted that you have such a warm enthusiasm for following in the footsteps of Christ and helping to proclaim the three angels' messages. With Christ at the very center, our righteousness, the one who is providing us with the way of eternal life. God bless each one of you in Saba, and remember that you're part of this wonderful world family and that God intends to come and take us home soon. And if I don't see you here on this earth, many of you are not there at the stadium, if I don't see you, I plan to see you in heaven very soon. God bless each one of you here in Saba. Maranatha.